Hi survivors, it's me preppers and reporting to you. Hope you guys are doing well because what's going on in this world is not. The video that got me in trouble yesterday was what's going on with the previous leader. And I put up a video where people were defending him and um, they gave me a strike and um, I was told if I do that again and that I also need to take down other videos and then if I did it again, uh, I could be banned from the platform. So that's what happened yesterday. I mean, I'm not shocked. So, um, of course, quite naturally, I'll have to be very uh, careful if I'm going to stay on this platform with uh, the things I say and the content that I put out to the public. It's crazy how they want everybody to go along with what they're doing or whatever their narrative is. But people are not stupid. Like the, the people that's running this world, they so stuck in their, their ways. I'm not gonna use a particular word I really wanna use because I don't want to offend, offend people. But I don't think people should be allowed to be leaders that's still stuck in old days and old times. And we're living in a new era. All the stuff they doing is so stupid. We living in a technology era. We living in an era where these kids are so advanced so they can run the world. A lot of these kids are that advanced. A lot of these kids know more about, the, uh, about technology and working these computers than we do. And they're very intelligent. We have people running the world who still stuck back in uh, 1920 somewhere and don't really know what they're doing. And then they want to run everybody's life. And then they want everybody to think how they want us to think and do what they want us to do. And that's not working for a lot of us. They're trying to also take control of what they think is going to occur in regards to C-I-V-L- that word, then W-A-R. Because they feel like that's about to occur because of all of these events that have been going on. It's getting ugly. It's getting uglier. I want to see how long it's going to last. They think that they'll be able to continue to censor people before these people, like this platform, don't have a platform. Because people are going to eventually get off of it and go elsewhere and have their own thing going. That's what I predict will happen. Because if they think everybody want to hear the same thing and see the same thing, they wrong. And if they think everybody want to hear people going along with what they got going on, they're wrong. It's good to hear different sides of the story and different perspectives instead of just one side, you know? I'm not letting it worry me because I have bigger fish to fry. We all do. And that's getting prepared for all this. That's a major job and major responsibility in itself, you know? So I'm not, I'm not sitting here worrying myself about being censored and all these types of things, you know? I, um, I have to keep going and uh, I just have to be careful of the messages that I convey and the way that I convey them. I don't wanna make myself a target anyway, honestly. Because I don't think it's worth it.
I'm not gonna make myself a target and put myself in no risk. Like, oh, this person's going down the wrong way. You going down the wrong way? <laughs> they going down the wrong way. Y'all see this? Look. This is a one-way street. They caught on to it. They turned around now. <laughs> so, with that being said, I'm gonna keep on uh, prepping and praying and uh, staying watchful. I had to come to the city today, come downtown and take care of some business, and I'm gonna be right back out of here. Yeah, it's getting thick out here, y'all. It's getting real, real nasty. Real nasty, real quick, real fast. Stay prepping, prepping, stay pr praying, and stay making sure you have plenty of water. That's very, very important. There's evil going on on every side, y'all. I'm here to tell you. There's so much evil going on. And they have a lot of different changes in YouTube is what I heard. So anything that I promote in regards to merchandise or land, I own it. The land that I have for sale in the bug out area is mine. It's mine. I own it. The t-shirts that I sell as far as the merchandise, it's mine. I own it. I don't sell anybody else's uh, merchandise and products. And I, they said that we have to say that if we're going to be promoting anything on here. So these things I have, I, um, I have full ownership of. All right, so that's my disclaimer. I had to come out and, and say that. I'll come out with more content. I haven't taken a, a break from YouTube in the last year and a half since I've been on here. I've, I've posted every single day, you know? And uh, so I might take a couple of days to regroup myself and um, to take care of some prepping business and um, to do more better videos, you guys. And I thank you all for the support. Thank you for watching. Stay alert, stay ready. Time is drawing near before it all goes down. Please follow me on my other platforms. Give this video a, a video a thumbs up. And uh, if you're looking for land and bug out areas, a house up for selling lease, links are, will be in the description on my website. Please uh, support the allegedly t shirts and uh, good luck with t shirts. Good luck with that t-shirt. If you'd like to make a donation to the channel, you can hit the thanks button. I'll have other information in the description. Please watch this world. Watch the weather. Smell your water. Boil your water. Or purify your water before you use it. And keep surviving as always.